Chief Executive Officers and Line Managers from the District Development Authority will undergo a leadership framework training at the PNG Institute of Public Administration later in March. The leadership is to educate them on their roles and responsibilities. It's also to ensure effective delivery of government services. This was outlined by the Acting Executive Manager of the Learning and Development Centre on Friday at the PNG IPA workshop at the Kokoda Trail Lodge outside Port Moresby. My Kayak reports. In an interview with NBC News, Mr Nemala confirmed that training on leadership framework will be held on March. This is to highlight the roles and responsibilities of the Chief Executive Officers and Line Managers from the district development authorities. This year we would like to uh, be more focused on where the government is focusing right now and that is the district development. Uh, so uh, we will uh, deliver about about four, four deliveries all around uh, district uh, development authority. Mr. Nemala said the training is to support the national government's target to deliver services effectively to the people. The government sees that uh, the public service demand in service delivery is very high and we need uh, very good leaders who, are, uh, who have the, uh, you know, the needed value, uh, the, the capacity to, to make service uh, being delivered efficiently and effectively. He was backed by Peter Sapsi, the Deputy Director of PNG IPA. Mr. Sapsi said the leadership training will also involve females to promote gender equality. And uh, developing leadership in women is also very important. And uh, at the PNG IP, we have also already developed programs, uh, short programs, that addresses the issue of uh, leadership in women and also the middle managers in the public sector. So these programs will be advertised this year and uh, we encourage uh, middle managers as well as uh, aspiring women leaders uh, to take note of this and uh, attend these programs because uh, they are very relevant to very relevant and positive a bit uh, what is happening in this country at the moment. Meanwhile, the chief executive officers will be assessed by the PNG IPA on their performances after the training in their respective districts. The reports will be submitted to the provincial governments and the Department of Personal Management for verification. Mark Kayok, NBC National News, Port Mosby.